This is McCook's Mr. Bill's an honor to have you here. The holidays means you're going to have a lot of different expenses. Traveling expenses, perhaps. Maybe you're going to cook big meals for the family. With Christmas coming around the corner, you're going to have a lot of expenses, maybe for toys for the kids or gifts for your family and friends. Absolutely. Your dollars are going to be stretched thin. But that's not the only people wanting your money. Nonprofits will come out of the woodwork through mail and through phones, begging you for money, giving you tearjerker uh, reasons to give to them. Even though only 10%, if you're lucky, actually goes where it belongs. Because the guy calling you is getting a big fat paycheck just to call you. With that in mind, though, I would like to remind you, though, that your tax dollars have already covered so much of that. Absolutely. You see, the Bible says you're supposed to give 10%. But in fact, the bottom of the pay scale, employees, that's right, they're still paying 30% of their money in taxes. 30% when you figure every product they purchase has taxes hidden in it. Not counting sales tax that's dumped on top of that. You bet. And taxing in every possible way you can think of by the government. And of course there's fines on top of that, which is another tax. But be that as it may, your taxes feed the poor in this country. Six different ways they can get food, including their children, can get food at breakfast and dinner at school for free. Add fuel to the fire, you give them also a place to live, a nice home to live in, or an apartment, absolutely, for free. You also give medical care that would cost tens of thousands, maybe hundreds of thousands of dollars for the poor. You help the poor through your taxes. Absolutely. It goes beyond that though. You know that your tax dollars go to protect and to help wildlife in the United States and around the world. Did you know that? Did you know your taxes go beyond the borders to help the poor in other countries where their rich are too lazy and too evil to help their poor and so we, the taxpayers, help them? You bet. We also, through your taxes, protect the world. We have a massive military force playing policemen around the world to keep the baby Hitlers from becoming any worse than they are right now. Absolutely. Your tax dollars do all of this. Absolutely. Meaning that you've already given your 10% and a lot more and a lot more. So when they ask you to give, you have the right to say, I've already given. I'm not telling you not to give wherever and whatever you wish to give and to whomever, but realize you've already given. Thank you for your time.